Many cities across southeast Texas are still dealing with mass flooding. Candy Wise JJ Maldonado spoke with a journalist from Beaumont today and a local mental health expert on dealing and disconnecting from Harvey. Thousands affected by Hurricane Harvey. Erica Walker, a producer for KBMT in Beaumont, says her city is dealing with the effects of mass flooding. Houses still up to waist protection. Um, we have had a few, I think as of now we've had three deaths in Beaumont alone. Meanwhile, many others in Texas and the country remain fixated on the outpouring of videos and photos of the damage caused by Harvey. Kevin Wade, a mental health expert, says this may have a greater effect on you than you thought. Watching it on TV can actually affect people much the same way as if I was there watching it happen um, in real time. Sometimes you may need to put the phone down and give yourself a digital detox. Taking a day away from all the overflow information may be healthy for you. Being able to take a step back and not be so fixated on all of those things and having to see every image and every video um, is very helpful for people. There are other ways to stay informed while putting away social media. Reading a couple of articles here and there. You don't have to watch the videos. You don't have to listen to the audio. Instead of feeling guilty for not knowing what's happening in the world. Do something that's going to help somebody else. Go volunteer somewhere and do something that's helpful. Meanwhile, for those unable to disconnect from the constant flow of information. I'm thinking about others right now. I'm concerned about other people that are out there. You know, I have to admit that's something I had to do because I grew up there and my parents are there. Fortunately, they didn't have any flooding, but all over my Facebook feed, you know, friends are being evacuated, losing things. And, you know, I'm pretty positive, but it gets depressing to see that.